back in the woods and today we're going to be checking out XTU's W10 Wi-Fi trail camera. So before we begin, let's go through the contents of the box. You get the trail camera itself, a tripod attachment, a mounting strap, USB cable, mounting plate and screws, and a user manual. So in its highest settings, the W10 is capable of 30 megapixel photos and 4K video, and with a 120 degree PIR lens, a 0.2 second trigger speed, and a 25 meter day and night vision range, you're not going to miss any of the action. There's also no worries about inclement weather, as the W10 is IP66 waterproof. So with all that being said, you can hook this trail camera up with confidence. And when you return to check out your footage, you can simply hook up your phone via the Wi-Fi connection on the trail camera, and view or download your footage or photos straight to your phone. Now, when it comes to powering this camera, the W10 requires eight AA batteries. And if you don't skimp on the quality of your batteries, W10 has a standby life of up to six months. Now, moving along, let's jump into the inner functions of the W10. Now, as you can see, when we turn the camera on, there is a security feature that requires a passcode. This, of course, is optional, but with a passcode, it will render the camera pretty much useless if stolen. So on our main 2.4 inch LCD screen, we're given information such as what mode we are shooting in, the quality settings we are shooting in, the time remaining on our memory card, battery life remaining, date and time. So jumping into the menu, we have everything in here that we need to configure our settings of this camera exactly how we want them from mode. We can switch it up to photo and video or simply photo. It's currently only on video. PIR interval sensitivity, time-lapse, switching over to the image settings. We can change the size of the image. Video settings, we can change the resolution. And here we have the date and time format. So we're gonna aim our trail camera onto this trail behind us, have multiple deer bark at us from this trail, so hopefully we'll get some pretty good action. So we have our XTU W10 in position, ready to go, super easy to get strapped to our tree here. So as mentioned, we can set it up for the long term using the mounting plate and screws provided. Alternatively, if there's a lack of any trees or adequate places to attach our trail camera, we can simply set it up to the tripod. Now, if you're unsure about whether the camera is looking exactly where you want it, you can simply connect the camera to your phone via the Wi-Fi connection. And from there, you'll get a visual of what the camera is seeing. You can configure your settings whilst in the app also. So we have our trail camera set up and ready to go. Let's see what it can do.
So as you can see, the footage displays information like date, time, temperature and the name of the camera, all of which can be altered to your preferences. I have to say I do like the quality of the images and videos captured, they are very crisp. I also like the fact that you can hook up your phone directly to the camera via its Wi-Fi connection, as opposed to previous trail cameras I've owned where I'd have to take out the memory card and insert it into a computer. Of course if you're a fan of the old school ways you can still use that method of transferring your footage, but by doing it with a phone and hooking up to the Wi-Fi, it's so much easier and quicker. As far as ease of use, you can navigate the menu and replay screens with no issues. Everything is easy to understand. There's no need to complicate things and XTU do not. As for battery life, I've had this camera out in the woods for the past two weeks and the battery life is still going strong, which again is awesome as I've had previous trail cameras where the battery would die after a few days and buying batteries isn't cheap. So battery life, excellent. And of course, being left out in the woods for the past two weeks, it's seen its fair share of downpours. But after retrieval, everything still works as it should with its rain, dust and fog resistance. I would say the microphone could be better, but then again, it is housed in a waterproof case. So it's give and take. And the other thing being the camouflage pattern isn't something that I'm particularly used to. It's a very dark camouflage, which if put in the wrong place would stand out. But if put in the right place, you're winning. Overall, I can only sing the XTU W10's praises. It's excellent quality, excellent battery life, no nonsense, everything you need in a reliable trail camera. At the time of filming, the XTU W10 comes in at $99, a very reasonable price for a great quality camera. Link is in the description.